Hello, good evening. It's now time to bring you the latest in the world of business. My name is Adela Michelle. And let's go straight into our stories for tonight. The suspension of the price and stabilization recovery levy on petroleum products expected to have ended on December 31 has been extended by an additional month after an approval by President Ekufo Addo. The extension followed the advice of the NPA to the Minister of Energy to seek government intervention to mitigate the impact of rising prices of petroleum products on the world market. According to the NPA, the outlook of prices on the global market shows an upward trend and therefore there was the need to seek government intervention to lower the levies to cushion consumers from feeling the full impact of the rising prices. Now, the initial approval was granted in October last year to zero the price stabilization and recovery levies on petrol, on petrol um, diesel and LPG for two months. Let's just deal with the petroleum levy as some players in the petroleum downstream sector want governments to adopt a sustainable means to cushion full consumers. Petrochemical engineer Dr. Yusif Sulemana noted that multiplicity of taxes on the petroleum price buildup has been the setback in the deregulation regime at the downstream sector. The problems came when we started introducing so many taxes. So at the end of the day, when taxes are so much that like we have now, which is about 50% of the price bill that we pay at the pump, it will paralyze the regulation. So if you work out a model that can minimize these taxes, rearrange it in a way, we will see the vibrance of the regulation come into play. Chief Executive Officer of the Association of Oil Marketing Companies, Kwaku Ajimandia, agrees with calls to have some of the taxes on fuel to be reviewed. If there are certain things that the taxes were in for and we have somehow finished paying, we need to take them off or maybe vary them in such a way that and accommodate them as consumers. So that's what we should hold the government so that, we, so that some of them which are taxes which are not necessary or we have it as service useful purpose and take it off. Taxes imposed on petrol or diesel as listed on the National Petroleum Authority's website comprise the energy recovery levy, special petroleum tax, distribution margin, marketer's margin and bust margin.